Here's what's trending for August 29th. Members of the McCain family mourn the loss of late Senator John McCain. The private service was held at the Arizona Capitol and was the first time that the McCain family has been seen in public. The late senator will be buried in Annapolis at the Naval Cemetery this weekend. White House counsel Don McGahn will be leaving the Trump administration after the expected Senate voting of Brett Kavanaugh. McGahn has been regarded as one of the top lawyers in the West Wing. Democratic candidate and mayor of Tallahassee Andrew Gillum will face Republican U.S. Representative Ron DeSantis in November for the position of Florida's governor. Child neglect charges have been dropped for three of the five adults found with 11 children in a New Mexico compound. Prosecutors missed a 10-day deadline for a court hearing to establish probable cause for the neglect charges. A Cleveland Browns linebacker has been charged with insider trading. Michael Kendricks apologized for making nearly $1.2 million in illegal profits from four investments. The linebacker plans to cooperate with authorities and give back the illegal funds. The Green Bay Packers have signed Aaron Rodgers to a record-breaking deal. The quarterback was signed to a four-year $134 million extension with $100 million in guarantees the highest for any quarterback in the league. American soccer player Clint Dempsey has retired after a long and fruitful career. He is tied with Landon Donovan for the most international goals and was a key player for the U.S. men's national team. Today would have been Michael Jackson's 60th birthday. And those are the trends for August 29th.